proudly yeah, South African well. indeed. Well done, Triggerfish. Right now, <laughs> jumping back into the kitchen with the lovely Amy. Um, yes. yes, and right now we're about to put together a hummus. That's right. But with hummus. a twist, making it with orange juice. Exactly. We're using some clover crush orange juice to, to kind of zing it up a little bit. Exactly. So hey? what we're going to do is with the balance of the orange juice being a little bit sweeter, we're adding more spice. You've got that kind of yes. spicy, sweet, beautiful combination. We've got our lovely chickpeas over here, um, about two tins worth. So we're just okay. going to put them into the food processor. Right, let me come around the so side just... once again. There we go. And um, we've got our tahini here. And our tahini is literally our sesame seed yes. paste. So we've got about two tablespoons worth. We're just going to pour this in. So this is already kind of your founding base for a classic hummus recipe. And what's so great about chickpeas is that they're so versatile. And you can really just kind of play around with whatever you've got in your kitchen. That's but right. the orange juice is such a winner. So okay. we're going to add one big clove of garlic. That's a clove of garlic. It is a good <laughs> clove of garlic. <laughs> I'm not afraid of garlic. So. <laughs> and then over here, we've got some beautiful cumin All so right. we're just going to put this into about a teaspoon of each we've got some paprika and then we've got a little bit of cayenne pepper yes. that's adding our good spice i'm just adding a little bit of, little of that yes. so um obviously if you don't like too spicy food just kind of add a tiny pinch you can also use a little bit of chili if you don't happen to have cayenne pepper right then we're going to just add about start with about a quarter cup worth of orange juice okay because you so don't want it too runny you don't want obviously it too runny. and also when you when you do make hummus you normally put a little bit of water in so and yeah. lemon juice so this is kind of kind of replace your water okay. lemon juice content a little bit of olive oil again and some salt and pepper let's not forget so. <laughs> <laughs> all good um, and then if you can just give that it. a little whiz for me let's see what this turns out as all right there you go. can pop it and on I'll... for us there oh. Oh. <laughs> where's our blade where's our blade <laughs> well now now there's an epic light scene okay. fail <laughs> so basically you would just if you don't have a free processor what oh, am, I, am, I, am i even gonna try and am i even gonna try and put it in there we go Okay. Was that Graham playing a trick on us? I'm sure it was Graham that, <laughs> that, that was messing around. There Let's try go. it again. <laughs> there we go. Look, That's it's amazing. working. It's working. Okay. Okay, now we got a little bit more orange juice. Go for it. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> I can't actually believe what just happened. Okay, um, and let's do this again. That is so bad. There we go, that is coming together beautifully. <laughs> now that we have a blade. <laughs> now that we have a blade. So, preferably when you use this at a machine, just make sure that you actually have one of those spinny things in the middle. <laughs> That's supposed to chop everything Perfect. fine. Perfect. Okay, there we go. Okay, well, that looks beautiful. Yeah, so we've got a nice, um, beautiful, chunky kind of hummus. Um, and just Are we going to use a machine again? We are not. Right, I'm going to take safety, this out. <laughs> take it out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool, there we go. Perfect, so there I'm just going to scoop some of this into this beautiful bowl. <laughs> and just for Graham, I'm going to put coriander on here. Yeah, I know a he lot. Put that. a lot of coriander. <laughs> um, listen, the keyword is snack. Is that 23728? The keyword is snack. That is 23728 for your orange hummus. Exactly, so now let's just quickly do the last little sprinkle of some gorgeous little spices Ah, that's why you here. left a little bit. Yes, See, I was wondering. That's I was like, why. Amy. <laughs> you didn't use the whole thing. Yeah. And then a little bit of... Um, uh, coriander here. I love the fresh coriander with the orange combination. It's yes. just such a winner. So there we go. That's another beautiful healthy dip or spread. It's lovely for your sandwiches. Um, obviously to dip any kinds of crackers and crudités in just like our aubergine earlier. Um, and and stand, healthy. So healthy. And healthy. High in fiber, plant protein, really good for love you. Love it. Amy, Keep it in the fridge for a couple this is days. a Done. spoil for us on your Tuesday. So once again, that keyword is snack essence. That to 33728. Just smells smell. absolutely amazing. It'll be on our <laughs> website as well. That's expressoshow.com. Try something different. Try our hummus. <laughs>